Right, welcome back to another video guys. In this one we'll be checking the heart rate monitoring and the blood oxygen readings on the OnePlus watch that we got here. We'll be comparing it to the pulse oximeter that we have here and see how accurate it is. And now we've got the watch on, let's check the heart rate monitoring. What I noticed on this watch, I can find the heart rate, but I can't actually find the tile for the blood oxygen. So I have to go into the apps and go into here. Right, says so 95 for SPO2. The meter itself says 99. Right, let's move it up a bit further and have another go. There was an update recently because before it wasn't even reading. It will count down to about 10 seconds and then afterwards it will just stop. But after the update, that doesn't happen. Let's take this off. Right, let's go again. That's a 98. This is 98. It's much closer. That's better. Let's check the heart rate. All right, it's got a continuous, it keeps checking. It's 82, it's going to 78. Let's give it a second. Yep, 77, 78, 78. Yeah, it's pretty accurate as you can see. But on this watch, there's no ECG function and uh, no blood pressure. So it's just your heart rate and blood oxygen. If you've got any questions, leave them down in the comments. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.